Uh, hello guys, yes, uh, welcome here to another browser tutorial. Today I w I'm going to be showing you how to convert uh, a C program into assembly code without any hassle or without any knowledge of uh, assembly programming. And you can use this code into uh, all your other codes and it's up to you. So what we're going to do is, uh, let me first go to my desktop, sorry. I'm going to, you know, I'm, I want to create a file, a, a folder where I can keep all these files so that they don't get messy. Test on um, CD test. So. And what I'm going to do right now is uh, create a file called uh, test.c, which is our C file, and I'm going to write a very basic, simple uh, C. Uh, C program, uh, Hello World program, to demonstrate um, this to, dem to, de to demonstrate for this tutorial. Sorry about this. Sometimes I get not the main. Sorry. So. So I print F. Was that? So I'm just going to ignore hello world. Hello world. Yeah. Um, I return nothing. So yeah, basically this is it and uh, save it. And there you have your first hello world program. So I'm just going going to go ahead and change the file permissions. to see so so uh, this is where this is where it all comes up so I call up GCC that is my call my C compiler instead of uh, and I'm going to use a, a s which is a uppercase s and call uh, to call it to uh, refer it to my program that I've just uh, created that is a test to C and hit enter what happens it creates a file for you that is the text that s and uh, that's your file. That's it. That's the file that uh, has your assembly code. And if we were to go ahead and take a look at it, test that this. And voila! This is all that you need uh, for a normal uh, assembly code uh, to operate properly and uh, run on your computer. So um, I hope everyone knows a little bit about assembly. At least if you don't know how to program it, you know how to read it. So uh, we can understand by this uh, that that file is uh, not that important. It's just uh, important for debugging processes, for the debugging process, and um, this is uh, it calls uh, for write data because it's just only writing data. And uh, it, this function, uh, it's just this is not this is not a function. It's a library to hold uh, our string uh, function for the hello world and uh, the doc the, 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 doc te the sorry dot text, and uh, not English. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. So. Um, and then now uh, we have uh, our main program that starts from here but uh, we have uh, the that global that makes uh, our main function global that it can be called in anywhere in the uh, anywhere in the program so uh, we can see uh, this faster uh, just this fast take bit uh, creates a uh, space in the memory and in, and allocate space for uh, where our hello world uh, string is going to be kept and uh, so uh, as as it goes on here it uh, it moves our library that holds our string hello world to uh, to uh, uh, to uh, the register and uh, and then uh, it, it it moves uh, our world to, to, to the register and then calls a uh, put to a uh, echo reader out and then uh, to echo it to 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 to, to uh, put it on top of uh, the, the the stack and then the it moves uh, our our zero that is, that was uh, the return zero uh, to our EAX uh, that's on, on top of the stack and then leaves a retreat to the main program and that's how the whole program runs. So basically, what you have is a complete assembly uh, program that is ready for use. Now, uh, let, let me just get get out of that and. Uh, if we were to see how how this could compile up using using that very code, um, like let me see GCC uh, minus zero, and then let me just make test. Let me call it test dot test dot dot s 
we are still using the, the, the S file so we have already our executable if we were to run it this is what we get and um, that's hello world now the, the, the most uh, interesting part is that you can still um, uh, figure out a way how you can uh, get uh, if you're into shellcode writing and uh, shellcode scripting uh, you can convert it right from here into a into a shell uh, shell shell codes so with that i found that i just got to learn this recently and i don't know much about it but uh, it's, it's kind of way interesting for me i'm just trying to explore it so i thought that maybe it could help you guys too so uh what you do is called uh this small program called uh obj object dump it's a ob dump uh you just refer it ob dump minus d uh and the, the program that it has to dump and then it dumps for you uh, the whole program inside here and uh, we can see uh, if we could in function uh, mm, well, if you see yeah it all starts from right here and you can take uh, uh, this uh, the values the, va the values that, that are right here and uh, you can uh, compile up your shell code and uh, guys just stick around for uh, for more tutorials subscribe it my channel and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.